Right, so a little bit of a different video. EA have released uh, five 81 to 86 rated player packs. So you're gonna get five players between 81 and 86 rated. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna open all three of these available packs. So we're gonna spend 60,000 coins and we're going to see how much we can make back. What we're gonna do is we're gonna calculate the cost of you know the, the players we get back and have a look if we're gonna be looking at a profit or a minus, etc, etc. If you guys are new as well, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. It's kind of a video to kind of say like, are they worth it also it's a bit of fun to see if we can make it back so let's spend the 60,000 coins first pack minus 20,000 coins let's see can we make 20,000 coins back and I would like to mention you can get a rule breakers Dembele can't you now that is going to be a boards German center back is going to be Ginter uh, which is not great but no you can get Dembele I'm pretty sure he's an 86 rated and he's like 900,000 coins so you could completely luck out in that sense um, this is a very rough pack very rough pack. I'm going to have a look at Footbin and see how much this pack is worth. With all of these plays listed up going off of the Footbin prices, it's not looking good. 20,000 coins spent and in return we got 6,000 400 coins worth of players so for the first pack we're looking at a 13,600 coin loss pack number two we need something big to uh, kind of redeem ourselves now I'm not sure if you can actually get icons in this because I know there's some 86 rated icons I'll assume you can't once again I think that's going to be Illicic very unlucky um, a Furlan Mendy behind it as well would be one of the cards you really want to get you can get a Raphael Varane um, but let's have a look Oh, I mean, it's a little bit better than the last one, but it is still not ideal. Well, I suppose I was wrong. Pack 2 was actually worse than Pack 1. Pack 2, obviously, with 83s as low as they are, you can always hold them and sell them at a future point. But in the current state of the market, um, obviously, these expire in 12 hours anyway. We made 5,750 coins back, so we're looking at a 15,000 or roughly around the 14,000 coin loss for this one. Now, the last one, we need a big boy. We need a Furlan Mendy to literally make profit. We need a big type of player like that. Not a single walkout from any of them's unfortunate. Mirror. Oh, oh. oh I, I, why, why did my dumb ones just think I just got Ben Yedda? Ben Yedda is French. He's not German. I, I don't know why I thought I just got Ben Yedda. And once again, really, really, really poor pack. So the results are in, as you can see on the screen right now, 60,000 coins worth of packs, aka free 20,000 coin packs. Pack number one, we made 6,400 coins back. Pack number two, we made 5,750. And pack number three, we only made 3,950 coins back. So all up, boys, 16,100 coins made from 60,000 worth of packs, meaning we have received a minus 44,000 coin loss. That is not ideal, is it? That is not ideal. Uh, realistically, and once again as well, this is going off the footbin price of the players. We've listed them up on the transfer market of the current football, uh, football, the current footbin price uh, for PS4. So remember that. Now, honestly. Do I think these are worth to buy of coins? No. Even are they worth to buy FIFA points? Personally, no. If you do want to, you know, if you want to make profit, I mean, a rule breaker is Dembele. I believe is 86 rated. He would be literally, I think, the most expensive card you can get is a rule breaker is Dembele coming in at 900k. Uh, you've got Raphael Varane, who's an 86 rated. Furland Mendy is an 83 rated. I mean, you might be lucky. He's like, what, 90, 80,000 coins. So there's always that. But we're looking at a minus 44,000 coin loss. Unfortunately, lads, these packs just are not, they're not it for me, personally. I hope you guys did enjoy. Fun little different type of experiment video. Till next time, boys. I'll see you guys later.